Good evening to you people. Yes, it's evening and it's a whole video. Listen, I know I keep saying I don't want my channel to be a whole channel and I really don't. But these are the easiest videos for me to do because any other video stresses me out. The lighting, the position, how I have to move. It's just a whole lot of stuff. No memory on my camera. Can't upload the video. It's really been a struggle. But this is a whole video. I know you heard it all before and you're going to hear it all again today. As you can see from the title, this stuff is all from Dollar Tree. The Dollar Trees that I shop at on a regular basis, they always get things that seems like so long after other people have hauled it. But I do want to share what I picked up. And even though you may have seen these things, check out the video because these may be a reminder of some of the things that you wanted to pick up and at the time you didn't see them in your Dollar Tree. But one thing I like to look at in Dollar Tree and I always check out are their scarves. And as you can see, this is an infinity scarf. It's pretty long and usually I would wear these around my head some type of way. But I thought this was really pretty to wrap around my neck, you know, to keep my neck warm in the winter time. Or even um, to wear with a pretty spring outfit. But you can see how, why it is. And it's really pretty. It's not on um, polka dots. I guess it's some type of design. I don't know if you call these. We're going to call them polka lines. Polka squares. But it's really pretty. They had a lot of other ones. But this is the one that caught my eye. Because it's just so fall and winter ready. Even though it's a thin scarf that you can see right on through. But it's really pretty. Another thing I picked up I thought was really nice. It was this here. Um, what do they call this? A tote, well, they call it a tote bag. And you've seen these things around before. But I like this one. It had different colors. I got this one because it's purple and vibrant. And you, you see the pouch that it came in. So once you open up the bag, you have a little pocket there to put whatever you want in. It's not really thick, of course. What can you expect for a dollar? But it's really pretty. This is purple. I believe they have red and green and some other colors too. Now, usually when I go to Dollar Tree, I do pick up a lot of um, home items, but I really don't show those things. And I'm just gonna mention, look for their storage bags, aluminum foil, Reynolds wrap at that. And also those cleansing wipes. But I picked this up because I'm going to use it primarily for dusting, of course. But mainly because I told you guys I have a lot of spiders in my house. I seem to have less than when I first moved here, but they're still here. So I'm going to use this here for the cobwebs because there's cobwebs all the time. And do you know that cobwebs are spider webs that dust has collected on? It doesn't even look like a spider web anymore. It just looks like a long old cobweb. And I see them all the time in my house. So I got this. I used to use the broom, but... I think this is much better just to wipe away the cobwebs and of course they call this a duster and they have smaller ones but this is a great big old one and i'm going to use this for that another thing i picked up and i'm glad that i did because if you watched any of my other dollar tree holes you know that i picked up a lot of um candle warmers I'm I think that's what you call them. So I picked up some more of these unscented tea light candles. They burn really quick. So I don't know if um, these are meant to be used like in a sternum, if that's what you call it. Because they burn really, really quickly. But I do like to use them in my candle holders, candle warmers. Yeah. So I got 16 because before I think I bought like 8 and I go through them kind of quickly. So I should have got more, but I got these. They had these really cute cups. I like these because they're nice and thick. Nice and thick. And one thing I can say, if you need a couple of cups, a couple, Dollar Tree is always great for that. Do not buy a dozen because that's $12. You can go to a lot of stores and pick up um, a set of glasses or cups much cheaper than $12. So be careful when you want to stock up on cups if you're trying to get a dozen because again you'll end up spending $12 when you can go to say Walmart or maybe Target any other place and get a set of glasses less than $12. I picked these up too because I'm into plants but I end up breaking one. Yeah can you see I broke it clear in half but I bought these because I want to use them to plant some things in. I got two. I'm, I'm going to go back and get another one. I'm just disappointed I broke this one. But I have some sage and other 
um, herbs that I want to put um, in these little starter planters. I also got this, and I had asked people about this, and people were like, no, I wouldn't use that. But I got this um, Sunbeam 3 Outlet Wall Tap. And now I'm a little, um, I'm not sure if I want to use it, but I think I will try it. Maybe when I'm at home for something um, that I would need it for, and then when I'm not home, I'll unplug it or overnight. But I do need it because it has three outlets here but it's not that ul laboratory tested so i don't know i'm just hoping i'll be okay with it and it won't burn down my house but my eye was definitely drawn to these glitter base fillers there's 110 pieces in here and i got this um not necessarily to fill a vase but i mean the colors are very um christmasy ready for the holidays gold and red is really really pretty and I, like i said i'm not sure what i'm going to use it for but as you can see it's a vase um filler and i just may use it for that but then again not really sure i had wanted these for the longest time and i had never seen them in the dollar trees that i would go into and these are the hexagon shells and they only had five, so I got all five of them. I wish they would have had black, but they had these five white ones, and I swooped them up with the quickness. And as you can see, I really wasn't sure how big they would be when I would watch people's hauls, but let me just tell you, you can see pretty much that's how big it is. It's not really big, but it's going to be great in the bathroom, and you can display something small, knickknacks, so I'm gonna put something small here, I don't know. I have five of them, so. I'm gonna keep looking for them, because they have been out for quite some time, and like I told you, I'm just getting them at the Dollar Tree that I shop at, but that's okay, as long as they got them, right? This is something else that I picked up too, and these are, um, Cool Gear, then Chiller Legs. And this is what they are coming plastic like this. And here it is. And no, you don't have to twist them on or twist them off. I thought these was really soft. Oh God, I'm gonna end up breaking it. These are something that I really, oh, okay. So I can put, it. yeah, here it is, look. So I can take this out of the house, let's see. Well, maybe I don't want to. Let's see if it comes off. Well, it comes off kind of easily, so I don't know. Because if it tumbles over, it's definitely going to be a mess. But I don't know. I just thought these were great to have. I'm not sure what the perfect size cup would be for them. But I have them. I'm going to use them. And um, they are BPA-free. That's what they say here. And they're very thick. They're not flimsy or light. So I don't know if they are good. I wonder if they would be great for those for the red cups. I'm gonna try that. And I got these because I want to put them outside of the home. You know, it's the holidays. These are the LED leaf lights. And I got three boxes, and they are three feet. And it has. Does it tell me how many lights it has? Oh, it has ten lights, and you need. Um, two double a batteries but here is what it looks like and i thought these are really cute outside of my um house on the patio or the porch whatever you want to call it there is um a pole and i'm going to put these around the pole and light them up so every night i will have to go out there and light the pole but that's okay i just thought these would be really pretty for the fall so i got um three boxes of those but you know Dollar Tree always comes out depending on the season these little lights they probably have some for Halloween but I'm not really a strong Halloweenista Halloween person so I didn't pick them up another thing that I picked up was some planner stickers I used to plan I don't anymore but I um like these because I keep saying I'm going to continue to journal I have um, different notebooks with different things. So I think this would be great for that. I'll show you the big ones first. I got these here. So they're different um, things here. This one here pretty much is about payday to-do list. This one here is really pretty. I like it. Um, this is more like what you're going to do. I don't know. Maybe on the weekend type thing. If you can see it. 
I'll just show it to you without trying to figure out what they are for because I, I thought this was really, really cute. What I'm going to use it for, I don't know. I bought a notebook and some paper because my family was supposed to be having a family reunion 2020. So I'm going to decorate the book with this. Just put these up everywhere. Love. Thanks. Um, yeah, I thought these were really, really cute. Yeah, so I got these and there's some other designs on the back here. Yeah, so and then one of them, let me see which one. This one here, the real colorful one on the back, I see they have different things with fruit and stuff. So there's different um designs in here. Most of them have how many stickers? Let's see. And they're by Jod. I don't know if that means a lot to anybody, but they're by Jod. So Did I show you this one? This one has 43 stickers. And this one I can tell you is definitely about love. Yeah. And then there's some other ones on the back. I didn't realize they were different on the back, though. I would have prepared it some type of way to show them all to you. But you get the gist if you like stickers. I like stickers, so I plan on using those. And then I got these smaller ones here. And let's see these are now these seem to be pretty much the same. So what you see in the front is what it will be in the back. So here is one of the stickers. I'm just gonna show them to you. But I think they're so cute. This one here is about notice and see my city is there. Let me see, let's see, New York City. So you know that's going on something, probably going on everything, I don't know. Can you see it, New York City? And this one is really, really pretty. I like this one here, it has the stickers and the page, what do you call these, page turners or page notes or something, I don't know, but there's, a, there's quite a few of those there. Best day ever, love it, remember. And these all these small ones all have 58 stickers. Now this here, I love the color scheme, which is like a fuchsia, black, white, and gold type. And these are really pretty. Here's another really pretty one, blue and green. Really, really nice to brighten up your book and make you look forward to and wanting and, and helping you to look forward to writing or keeping a journal whatever it is that you start if you don't do it often put some stickers in your book or your planner that may help you a little bit now whenever i go to dollar tree i always stop in to see what they have as far as home decor i pick these up i think these are really really cute especially for a dollar these are jewelry stands i have some jewelry some light jewelry i'm going to stick on the branches here rather than pretty much just earrings light earrings and then use the catch-alls to put little rings and stuff in and this is gold and this is like a pearlized white and i think they're really really cute really really cute most of the other stuff i have here yeah um beauty stuff so i think um dollar tree is a great place to pick up nail files yeah they have these in lots of different styles but i picked this one up here and then on the back it's black this here from sassy i like the um black nail files but usually the ones you get from the beauty supply store the it's a little wider than this those nail files last for what seems like forever and i don't remember them being very expensive but i got these because i was in dollar tree so i figured i'd get these and try them Another thing I picked up that I had tried once before from Dollar Tree was a bl blender sponge. So this is a blender sponge. And I think I showed you guys in a previous hole in the empties hole that I did why I threw it away because it's gotten so hard. But this one, they have different colors. This is a light blue one. And I really do look forward to using it. Um, I didn't find the other one I had to be so bad. I mean... You, there are certain things you may not do with it. You may not want to use it to put on your foundation, but maybe something like um, patting your foundation in. I don't, I don't know, but I pretty much like them. And then I, at the time before I got the Fenty Beauty bronzes, I was looking for some bronzes. So I had these for a while and I got these two. This one here is bronzed 
beauty and this one is sun goddess so i got these two here i'm not sure which one would really fit me much i think this one is probably the one i'd really go toward i don't know we'll see we'll see but i got these two la colors and you know we dig la colors around here right another thing i got because i always pick up the mask when i see them yes two um are not very expensive but when i see them in dollar tree i do pick them up so this one here i got four two of each and this one here is a recharging Greek yogurt and probiotics mud mask. And it also has a de detoxifying charcoal mask. Okay, so there's two. Oh, no, there's three masks in here. Oh, okay, hold on now. So there's three different masks in this one. And both of them, as a matter of fact. One is the ultra hydrating mask, a detoxifying charcoal mud mask, and recharging Greek yoga and probiotics mud mask these are all mud masks one two three i didn't realize that i thought it was this only yeah you gotta pay attention right and then on the other one here this one also has three mud masks in it also so you have hold on is this the same thing okay they're not the, well they are the same thing because the first two are the same the ultra hydrating mud mask, the detoxifying charcoal mud mask. But this one here is different because the other one had the Greek yogurt. This one here is the calming mud mask. Yeah, I didn't realize that. I thought this was whole a whole one, but no, there's three in one. So that's not bad for a dollar, right? Because I love masks. So as a matter of fact, I think I'll do one, not one of these, but one of the other ones I picked up from before. Now, something else that I picked up and I was really surprised that I found it because usually, like I said, when I see something new on YouTube, because that's where I'm watching, right? Um, it almost takes a whole year before I find the particular thing that I would like to see in the Dollar Tree that I shop in. But this surprised me a great deal. They had quite a few. They didn't last long. I got two. I should have gotten another one. And that's the Pro Tools Jade Roller, which looks like yay. So I got two of them. And I don't know. I told you before, I'm really skeptical with all these beauty claims and things. Um, so I'm not really sure how this one would fare towards the one that would be the original or the genuine one, I'll say. But I got this because I did want to try it. It's pretty heavy. Got some weight on it. Yeah, so I'm, I'm looking forward to trying it. It's supposed to reduce puffiness and wrinkles, um, improves blood circulation and elast elasticity in even your skin tone. And it's supposed to tighten, soothe, and minimize your skin's pores. Now, that's all that it says there. You can see that. But that's what it says it's supposed to do. Something I saw and I thought was really cute. Because you can never have too many makeup bags. A makeup bag for when you travel. A makeup bag for when you just want to leave the house for a couple of hours. Take your makeup to your girlfriend's house. Whatever it may be. But I saw this and I thought it was so cute. It's really big. It's really big. As you can see. It's really long, so a lot of makeup can go in here. Nothing really heavy because it's not really wide. It's really just a flat envelope, but it's really pretty. I like what it has on it. Good vibes, lipstick, XOXO, make every outfit count, um, all eyes, perfect. Life isn't perfect, but my makeup is. It's really, really cute. And, it ha and the thing about it is that it was just laying off to the side. So usually when I see things like that, I do not pick them up. But I couldn't find these in the store anywhere else. So I saw this one and I got it. I, I don't know if it comes in any other designs. If you've seen this, let me know. It has like a crinkly, which you can't really see. It has like a crinkly type of texture to it. It's not smooth at all. I don't think there's any way I can really show you what I mean when I say. But it's really, really cute, and I really, really like it. As a matter of fact, if you really get um, creative with it, you can carry this as a pocketbook on a casual day. Your little clutch, clutch baggy on a casual day. Yeah. 
So those are the things that I picked up from Dollar Tree. I'm really sad about my glass planters, but I'm going to get some more of those. And I hope I didn't break the other cup because I was just dropping stuff all over the place. But I'm really looking forward to trying these masks here. For sure. And the um, blender here. Yeah. So, I am not going to keep you any longer than I already have. I'm going to end this video now. And I'm glad that you stopped by to watch the video. I hope you watched it to the end. And if you did, thank you. But while you're here, you may as well go ahead and subscribe. My channel is just fun for me. I have a lot of fun here. And I like interacting with everyone. So, drop me a line. Let me know that um, you're a Dollar Tree shopper too. And some of the things that you've picked up. Because after I end this video, I'm going to go watch some more Dollar Tree videos. And just create a mental list of things that... I really don't need but anyway like I said I'm gonna end this video now I just want to um, thank you for stopping by and watching y'all hey and share and spread love I can't believe I got this video completed now I gotta get it uploaded